navigate this demanding warp speed world, we can all use a helping hand. But how do you know who to trust? One company cares for every man, woman, and child on our planet. Cobra Industries. Accelerating global communications, Cobra connects you. Innovating advanced medicines, Cobra sustains you. Modernizing defense technologies, Cobra shields you. Now you know, and knowing is half the battle. She all right? He's in shock. Roblox, keep him back! not to hurt anyone. Yeah, don't think they're playing by your rules. Where's my blue ribbon lady, Jay? I have something better. Orders from above. You get to escort an intel desk jockey on a security detail. Babysit a spy. Not alone. Don't worry. I'll find you some new friends. One of these days, Weems, your feet are gonna end up where your ears used to be. Good thing I wear comfortable shoes, sir. Private Lee, what are you doing? Being all I can be, <laughs> ma'am. Corporal Hinton. Hey! <laughs> oh, where you been crawling, Tunnel Rat? Who's Tunnel Rat? Apparently you are. Thanks for the new friends, Lady J. Lieutenant O'Hara, Army Intelligence. Sergeant Hauser. My friends call me Duke. I know. I do my homework. Well, what do we call you? Hey, how about Scarlet? Only, you know, because of hair. Try ma'am, Weems. I am your superior officer. Yeah, guys. So, Scarlet, mind briefing us? <sighs> this is the Cobra Pharmaceuticals manufacturing plant, three clicks north of Springfield. Uh, isn't that a civilian facility? It also produces vaccines for the military. We've been called in to investigate a terrorist threat. We're unarmed. What can we do against terrorists? Nothing. I'll break it down slowly. This is a show. Big, strong army guys are going in to make the civilians feel safe. You boys don't have to strain your brains. You just have to follow orders. Understood? Yes, ma'am.
pick a lane and let me pass, roadblock. See, he called you roadblock because you're big, and you were blocking his way. The dude is hilarious. Maybe we should call you incredibly annoying guy. Who better watch his mouth. Sir, five incoming, military. U.S. Army would never show up unannounced. Welcome to Cobra Pharmaceuticals. May I help you? Army Intelligence. I need to speak to your security chief immediately. Do you have an appointment? I don't need an appointment. I represent the U.S. government. Bring him out here now. Uh, one moment, please. You might want to switch to decaf. Scarlet. Oh, whoa, we're friendlies. We're investigating a terrorist threat. On the floor, lady. Hey, hands off. Hands behind your head. Did you get that out of my face? Duke, stand down. We are here by the authority of the United States government. Both of you, stop. <laughs> We need reinforcements! Sir, do you copy? Are you okay? It only hurts when I breathe. What happened? You tell me! Ah! Lasers? Where did they get lasers? I'm out! Snake Eyes is with me. Dude's nickname is Snake Eyes? And you had nothing to do with it. Imagine that. Someone's coming. Clear. Clear. I'll initiate lockdown. Secure the perimeter. You find the schematics? I know, but we have to eyeball the lab. Nobody called in a terrorist threat. What's our real purpose here, Scarlet? I'll explain everything. After you've changed. Why are we sneaking around? You got a problem with Cobra? Don't let their smiling face fool you. Cobra Industries is a front for arms dealing, immoral science, and extortion. Come on, Cobra makes medicine here, Lieutenant. My mom's worked at a Cobra bakery for nearly 10 years. Cobra does bake a tasty apple pie. Cobra's pure evil, but the military has never had proof until now. This building schematics reveal a subterranean level. So we got shot at and nearly killed because Cobra has a basement? A basement full of something, I just know it. Thank you. All I know is that you've lied to us, risked our lives, and made us accessories to a half a dozen crimes. I'm taking you in. If I'm right, General Abernathy will pat you on the back. If I'm wrong, you'll be handed a medal for blowing the whistle on me. Sound fair? General Abernathy? Somebody has friends in high places. Hard to believe somebody has friends at all. This ain't your mama's cobra. Has to be a mistake. Our mistake. Yeah, we've seen the rec room. Can we go now? I'll agree, it's weird. But what does this sideshow prove? A friend? You could have said something about the magnetic train tracks. No, he couldn't. What, the dude can't talk? Wish I could say the same for you. Anybody else wondering why there's a train running down here? I apologize for not being able to join you in person, but I wanted to express my gratitude 
to all for supporting Cobra's latest philanthropic endeavor, the Veterans Health Consortium. Now, please, enjoy the party. General Abernathy, thank you for coming. Would you care for another espresso? No, thank you. Baroness? Please, call me Anastasia. Tell me, Anastasia, when do I get to meet your elusive boss? Mr. Ducobre is a very busy man, General. If you'll excuse me. General, we've never met. I'm Lieutenant Shana O'Hara an officer in your investigative division. I am on the verge of obtaining hard proof that Cobra Industries is involved in all manner of illegal activity. Scramble all phone signals within 50 meters. I've infiltrated a secret Cobra lab in Springfield. Major Hidalgo, do you know a Lieutenant O'Hara in intelligence? Name sounds familiar. Find out what she's up to ASAP. Sir, we had a security breach, and I thought, Yo! Friend to cop! Never interrupt an artist at work! You know what I'm making down here? Your replacement! I know. I know the teeming masses will call you unnatural, immoral, even evil. But you'll always be my baby. Who's young Frankenstein? Brian Binder, a.k.a. Mindbender. I like the name. Badly wanted by the feds for multiple crimes against nature. So what's he doing in Cobra's basement? Baking up some apple pie? Doesn't matter. We're taking him in. No. I have all the proof I need right here. We're leaving. Eh, no worries, Sarge. We'll just come back with a search warrant, pitchforks, and torches next week. So we're staying? No, a nod means we're leaving. What are we nodding about, anyway? Hey! This area is restricted. You! You're the security breach. And you're under arrest. Doubt it. Everybody sees the lava lamp coming at us, right? Open fire! How much? Soldier, Cobra lets me do anything I want down here. After you five are recycled into my bio matrix, you will be reborn as super soldiers. Granted, it's just a work in progress, but you may well be the first unit in Cobra's very own bio viper army. Can I get a doctor? I understand there was a security breach at the lab. 
uh, handled it. I mean, some green shirts busted in to arrest me. Go figure. And I expect a full report. I know, I know, I disobeyed orders. Didn't want to. <sighs> expect a court martial soldier. I outrank him. You're pardoned. Help roadblock tunnel rat. You're not gonna let the nickname thing go, are you? Junior! Dinner! Shut down the assembly line. Controls are locked. We can turn the whole factory into a big old cherry bomb. How? Time that generator fires, boom, shakalaka. Then let her rip, ripcord. Ripcord? Me likey. Crap. Where's Weems? Want to cover your ears, doughboy? No! Attention, all personnel, evacuate. This is not a drill. about Snake Eyes. I wasn't. Major Hidalgo, we just came from the Cobra Lab in Springfield. What happened out there, Lieutenant? Long story short, we've acquired proof that Cobra's involved in things you wouldn't believe. We have to get this to General Abernathy right now. Everyone back in the truck! Sir, we lost a man back there. I need to check in with base command. And I need you to brief General Abernathy. That's an order. Why are we being transported in a stolen civilian vehicle? Relax. Check this out. Authorities now believe robbery and sabotage were the motives behind today's explosion. At Cobra Pharmaceuticals, police seek a group of US Army personnel led by this man. Sergeant Conrad Hauser. As seen here, the armed men force their way into the plant at gunpoint. Hey, where's the part where Cobra shot first? Since the explosion resulted in at least one fatality, Hauser and his men are wanted for murder. Being set up. Major Hidalgo.
I'm thinking the secret she managed to record are worth twice the number we originally agreed upon. What do you say? I say, you're fired. <laughs> How do we prove we're not criminals? We can't trust anyone. We can trust General Abernathy. As you can see, crews are struggling to put out the many fires. Lieutenant O'Hara, what in Sam Hill have you been doing? I had pictures, sir, of the real Cobra. Unfortunately, the proof has been destroyed, but I know where we can find much, much more. Let me guess. At the Cobra plant, you and those soldiers incinerated. Sir, if you'll just let me explain. Explain? You acted without orders, Lieutenant. You and those men will accept responsibility for going rogue. End of discussion. Now surrender yourselves. General, we've been set up. Until you can prove that, son, I can't help you. No one can. Previously on G.I. Joe Renegade. This area is restricted. You're under arrest. Open fire! <laughs> I want to cover your ears, Doughboy! No! You acted without orders, Lieutenant. General, we've been set up. Until you can prove that, son, I can't help you. No one can. Don't move! Stay where you are! Military and local law enforcement remain on high alert as they continue to hunt for the soldiers who, allegedly, infiltrated and destroyed a Cobra Pharmaceuticals manufacturing plant near the town of Springfield last night. Viewers with any information that might lead to the capture of the suspects are urged to call the number shown on screen. I'm Bender Report. I need you to make absolutely certain that every thread linking Cobra to your experiments has been destroyed. Yeah, about that. I think one of my chicks may have wandered from the nest. Are you saying a bio-viper survived the explosion? I know. Is that fan flippantastic or what? These things are even more kick-butt than I realized. I just put all my resources into covering up their very existence. Now you tell me, one is running loose? Hello. I may have created an unstoppable killing machine here, and that was only a beta test. I think some props are in order. Perhaps I should alert the commander that your killing machine is going public well ahead of his schedule. Shutting up. Tracking BioVipers. I'd like to say a few words about our fallen comrade, uh, Private First Class Wallace Wings. I, uh, <clears throat> I didn't really know Weems. Uh, none of us did, I guess. Actually, uh, actually found him kind of annoying. I mean, specifically the whole nicknaming thing. Yeah, it's, it's good, man. It's all right. <sighs> Wallace Weems gave his life to save ours. We will make sure his sacrifice was not in vain. Done? Good. I found Santa's sack in the spare tire well. And by Santa, I mean Mars Industries. We need to find out why Cobra's in bed with the world's largest arms manufacturer. Scarlet, show some respect. It's Lieutenant O'Hara, and we'll have time to mourn Weems after we expose Cobra and clear our name.
So pick a sidearm and let's move. That's an order, soldier. You don't get it. There's no rank here anymore. We're equal opportunity fugitives. Even fugitives need a leader. How many tours of duty have you done? How many combat missions have you led? Don't want to take orders from me? Fine. But our priority is still the mission. There is no mission. Our priority is the men. That means food, water, and medical treatment for your leg. <laughs> Whoa. Uh, yeah, n not to break up the love of spat, but I do have field medic training. And I could wrestle up some child. He liked Ripcord as a nickname, Weems. It was the last thing he said to me before. Have you found the hatchling yet? Well, let's just say I've narrowed down its flight path to a five mile radius. And that's the good news. The bad news is that radius is a backwoods burb called Springfield. Put the bird in a cage now. So what kind of threat are we trying to contain here, Baroness? These old analog receivers still pick up stray signals. And I know when someone's speaking in code. Congratulations, General Abernathy. Your rogue soldiers are also bioterrorists. When they destroyed our facility, they released a lethal virus into the water supply. Now we need to seal off Springfield. My best intel specialist is leading the manhunt for these fugitives. We will bring them to justice. Meantime, I'll mobilize a unit to assist you with the evacuation. The military has done enough damage, General. Cobra will handle this ourselves. Attention, this area has been exposed to a contagion and will be sealed off in one hour. Inside the quarantine zone, you will be directed to a Cobra Mobile Decontamination Unit. That should scare off the curious. Now retrieve your Bio Viper. It's a mindless collection of bioengineered aggression and survival instinct. You can't just whistle for it like a puppy. But I'm sure it will come running when it gets hungry. <laughs> oh, something crawl in there and drown? Man, you ain't lived till you taste my granny's wild mushroom cap stew. Don't! Those are hominitis. They're poisonous. <sighs> Trust me, I spend a lot of time in the dirt. I uh, hope those ain't for dessert. Don't be disgusting. They're for Spy Lady's leg wound. Thanks, but no thanks, Tunnel Rat. Again with the Tunnel Rat. Snake Eyes, lower your weapons! That's Bio Viper material, isn't it? Where'd you find it? In nearby Springfield. Hey! Which has been evacuated and sealed off due to the release of a lethal virus. This is clearly the work of the same criminals who destroyed our pharmaceutical plant. Rest assured, Cobra will assist any and all of the infected. There were no contagions in that lab. Cobra's going through a whole lot of trouble to shut down a town. Don't tell me one of those things we bullseye blowed up and barbecued is still walking around. We need to warn the authorities. Who will believe us? If that freak show is running loose, it's partly our fault. I won't allow more innocent lives to be lost. And unlike you, Scarlet, I got an inside contact we can depend on. Base command. Hey, Lady J. Duke, where are you? I can't believe what they're saying about you on the news. Don't. I need you to get a combat unit to Springfield, stat. I can't explain right now, but... Oh, no, you don't. Start at the beginning. <sighs> All right, but you're not gonna believe me. Uh, can't talk now. Bye, Mom. May I help you, sir? Skip the protocol, Sergeant Burnett. Lieutenant Dashiell Fairborn, Army Intel. But you can call me Flint. You and I are gonna be spending a lot of time together. I don't date suits. 
It says here Sergeant Hauser, AKA Duke, once saved your life. Now's your chance to return the favor. I don't owe nobody nothing. I know you don't want Duke going down in a hail of gunfire. That's why you're gonna help me bring him in. Alive. Let's move. Uh, sir, maybe we should send the combat unit out to Springfield. Don't make me regret bringing you on board, Sergeant. Duke would never be stupid enough to go back there. I can't believe I let you talk me into going back there. Aren't you the one who's determined to take down Cobra? Yeah, but I'm not the one foolish enough to return to the scene of the crime. Remind me, why are we bringing the ninja along? Because he has a sword and he knows how to use it. Attention, citizens. This is the last call for evacuation. This entire area must be sealed off in 10 minutes. Corporate scum! Don't you worry about no virus, Mitchell. Everything those cobra weasels say is a lie. What is it, buddy? Are you sure there's no virus, Dad? Looks like something sucked the life right out of him. Guess he owes you some leeches. So, how do we get in? 12 o'clock. Okay, now how do we get out? I'm telling you, there's a the thing! Hallucinations. First symptom of the virus. Should have amoosed while the amoosing was good. Is that a hallucination? That's a trick Daddy didn't know you could do. Bring in the tube. Be a good synthetic soldier. <laughs> Or did you Cobra scum unleash on our town? Let's get one thing straight. We are definitely not Cobra. Who are you then? We're just ordinary Joe, sir. And we suggest... You run! Take a lot more than a sword to stop that thing. Yo, Townie! Let's try going underground. Mindbender, what's going on out there? I didn't order an assault. It's those soldier boys. The ones that torched my lab. They're alive and kicking. Not for long. What did Mr. McCullen send us? Ah, fuel air explosive. Mars Industries manufactures the best toys. No, 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 no. I mean, aren't we missing a primo opportunity here? 
I mean, heavily armed enlistees trapped inside an electronic battlefield with an unstoppable force of nature? This is gonna be entertainment at its finest! I have no time for foolishness. Prepare to launch. That's too bad, because I know the Commander has a lot riding on the success of his BioViper program. Now, I'd hate to have to tell him that you put the kibosh on the ultimate field test. Abort. For the moment. We're getting reports of a firefight in Springfield. General Abernathy wants to check it out. Looks like Duke might be just that stupid after all. Plan. There was a plan? You all right? <clears throat> Much in the way of evidence, but it's a start. Have you seen my son? Hold your fire! <clears throat> oh, they grow up so fast. We can't shoot at it. We have to find another weakness. Haven't you been paying attention? That grizzly don't do weakness. <laughs> Not grizzly. More like spud. This is plant material. I already told you, I spend a lot of time in the dirt. See how it sucks out the nutrients? So why ain't it done that to my son? And yeah, maybe it ain't that hungry. Yet. Point is, we found a weakness. So all we need is a boatload of weed killer. And where do you expect to find that? We're on a farm, city girl. O'Hara in position. Duke in position. Yeah. Roadblock in position. <laughs> Subtle rat in position. That's right, I said tunnel rat. Let's go. Mindbender. Report back to me immediately. Uh, yeah, no can do. Um, wanted criminal? Tell Uncle Sam I said howdy do. Pack it up now! Lieutenant Fairborn, Army Intel. I am here at the behest of General Abernathy and I require access. Your general assured me there would be no military interference. Yes, ma'am. But seeing as how you aren't wearing a gas mask, I assume that the virus is all cleaned up and you can shut down the fence. Duke. 
Time's up. Shut that fence down now, or I will tear it to shreds. <laughs> Not bad for a bunch of ordinary Joes. We owe you our lives. We owe you a mess of weed killer. Let's call it even. You got guts, Lieutenant, for a spy. Call me Scarlet. Grunt. Freeze! Drop your weapons, soldiers. Hands where we can see them. The rest of you, stand back. State championships. Ten seconds on the clock. Inches from the end zone and trailing by six. Center snaps the ball, and what happens, Duke? You sack me, Flint. You, you know him? So, I'm guessing this situation feels a little familiar. Why'd you do it, Duke? Somebody pay you to blow up that plant? It's a long story, Flint. Well, I for one can't wait to hear the whole thing at your court, Marshal. Where's my Jeep? Next time, sir, I suggest you not leave your keys in the ignition. So where to now, Duke? Anywhere we could stay one step ahead of Flint. And make life miserable for Cobra. Unfortunately, we lost the BioViper prototype. But the virus cover will hold. Good. Then Cobra Industries will be spared further scrutiny in the wake of this incident. There is the small matter of the renegade soldiers. Small matters have a way of unraveling into loose ends. You know how I feel about loose ends. I trust you will handle these renegade soldiers with your usual efficiency, my dear Baroness. In fact, I command it. I feel my life slipping away here. You're trying to make my ears bleed, aren't you? There's a state police checkpoint ahead. Guess who they're looking for? We're boxed in, trapped like rats. Cops about to swarm. We'll be fine. Uh, oh, what? You're a magician? You're gonna make this truck grow wings? We need a distraction. <laughs> What is your crazy friend doing? You asked for a distraction. they didn't commit. A ragtag band of fugitives fights a covert battle to clear their names and expose the insidious enemy that is Cobra. Some call them outlaws. Some call them heroes. But these determined men and women think of themselves only as ordinary Joes. And this is their story.
told you we'd be fine. You didn't have anything to do with it! We can't count on the magic ninja to save us every time. We need to learn to blend in, right? Hello? We're trying to blend. Look around. Hereabouts people wear whatever they can afford. Some decent stuff here. Ah. <sighs> Once a grunt, always a grunt. The goal is to not look military. <gasps> you wanna fight? I'll fight! <laughs> Come on, man, you gotta calm down! Hulk, soldier! You're not on a battlefield. Oh, this is a battlefield. Hey, 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 man. Why you want to be doing that, friend? No one's going to hurt you. <laughs> Everyone down! <laughs> You've done your good deed for the day, gentlemen. I'm sure Chicago's finest are on their way. We can't just leave them here. He's sedated. Is it post-traumatic stress, Doc? No, nor addiction, nor any other disease I can diagnose. And he's not alone. I'm treating three other vets found in the same condition. After all they've done for their country. The police will want to talk to you all. I'm not leaving Chicago until we find out what's happening to those men. I agree. Really? What's your angle? I was double-checking my old files and noticed Cobra has been shipping high-tech weapon parts into this area for some time. Guess what? There are no weapon manufacturers around here. If we can find out what Cobra... Cobra is looking for us. Are you trying to get arrested? I'm trying to clear our names. We're fugitives, lady. And I got nothing against those vets, Duke. But our own skins come first. We need to get out of Dodge now. You got my back, right? We could go, or we could stay. I'm good either way. You know what? Roadblock is the perfect name for you. All you do is... Ah, I'm out of here. Tunnel Rat, it's freezing. Let him go. Dude needs to chill. Call out tonight, huh? Yeah, you just win a genius grant? <laughs> just trying to help. My mission does a lot of work with veterans. You are a vet, aren't you? I don't need any help. How about some hot coffee? Coffee I can do. Just don't try to convert me. <laughs> I can't change what you are, my friend. friend. Ralph Pulaski. Where are we? Last thing I remember was uh, a cup of coffee and a preacher. Evening, Scrap Iron. How does today's catch look? Physically adequate, Mr. McCullen. As for their mental state, only time will tell. 
time is a luxury we do not have. Cobras demand a formal demonstration. We need a subject that will prove that our technology works. We might find a better candidate among your staff soldiers. I won't risk valuable grenadiers when these veterans cost nothing and are easily disposed of. Now let's hope we find the treasure among your street trash. Begin. Hey, who turned on the lights? Initiate the sonic tone. Ah, what is with that noise? My brain is gonna explode! Brainwaves are irregular. They're entering the combat mindset. Release them. Let's go get acquainted with the Preacher! Yo! You creeps better get us out of these things! The rage effect is coming on strong. Watch what you're doing! It wasn't me, it was this thing! Anastasia, your timing is impeccable. It's almost as if you have a spy here at Mars Industries. Why would I need a spy? We have no secrets, do we? I know you were expecting a status report, but I have something even better. Ooh, when can we share them with Mr. Decobre? Soon, we're in the final test phase. Cobra Industries will reap a very satisfying return on its investment, I promise you. When perfected, my new Exo Armor will be the most powerful weapon on any battlefield. Your toys always impress me, James. Perhaps Cobra should simply buy you out. As much as I enjoy working with you, Anastasia, Mars Industries will remain in the McCullen family as long as I walk this Earth. Oh, James, I simply meant... <laughs> Your guinea pigs are failing me. They're not the problem. It's the sonic tone. It's designed to stimulate fight or flight for maximum combat performance. None of the subjects can withstand the resulting rage effect. I know there's a soldier out there strong enough. Find him. I've nearly finished my sweep. Any sign of Tunnel Rat on the east side? No, he's been gone eight hours. You think he went AWOL? Hope you're happy, T-Rat. Got me hoofing all over downtown. <laughs> I didn't know where else to bring him. I never should have... It's not your fault, Roadblock. You again. A uh, friend... Your friend, huh? It says here your friend does not have a name. Look, Doc, I'm calling security. Another friend of ours. Acupressure. It's no cure. There won't be a cure until we find the cause. How? Forget it, Duke. And we're supposed to forget Tunnel Rat? No way. We have what he didn't. Back up. doing? Tunnel Rat hates your music. But he loves to complain about it. This is where I found him. No clue how he got here. Coffee. When we found him, Tunnel Rat had coffee stains all over him. Wait. 
Wasn't the other vet, Truman, harassing that preacher? Whew. I sure could use a hot cup of joe. What do I owe you? It's free, sir. You a veteran? I see my share of action. Hold on. I have some fresh brew. Mmm. That's strong. Whoa. Wondering why you're here? Don't bother. This isn't about thought. It's about instinct. That instinct in particular. But I prefer it not be directed toward me. You have been targeted. Take evasive action. Mr. McCullen, he's in a full-blown combat rage, but his brainwaves are holding steady. Promising. Begin recording. Let's see what he can do. This part of town is abandoned. You really think we're gonna find our preacher down here? I'm not looking for the Preacher. If this is Gelson Street, we're close. Close to what? Remember those shipments from Cobra I was tracking? They were delivered to that building. Again, with the Cobra. You know one corporation isn't behind every evil in the world. We'll see. I'll spare you the big fat I told you so if you find us a way in there. Incredible. He's immune to the rage effect. Now that we know what we're looking for, we can recruit soldiers with similar brain patterns in the future. His brainwave recordings are complete. Subtle. We're in, aren't we? Looks like this one has friends. Yeah, they won't be his friends long. Ah! Roadblock! Hang on, we'll break you out. He heard you. Take the wheel. What? Where are you going? Oh, Block! What are you trying to do to me? Duke, come in. Over. Duke, what's your 20? Come on, you stupid radio, work! Arr! Will you stop trying to scare me to death? Hey, your lady's in trouble. I'm guessing you know how to find her, right?
Whoa, whoa, big guy! You know all this anger ain't you. Right, bang your head, buddy. That's right. Let's get him out of there. That beeping can't be good. The sonic technology they were exposed to overstimulated the brain's survival reflex, eventually causing a mental crash. But this music seems to, well, reboot their minds. Just like I figured. Yo, what you guys did? Well, if it was up to us, you'd get medals. Hey, what do we call you? We're just... ordinary Joes, like you. All right then, Joes. If I can ever be of service, look me up. They used to call me Steeler. Dr. Greer, you have a call on line one. Any of you know a Lieutenant Fairborn? Where are they? They? Oh, right. You are looking for some soldiers, hmm? You know exactly who I'm talking about. I suspect we made a new enemy today. Oh, that's great. Because we needed more people shooting at us. Ain't nothing we can't handle. Negative, you know it.